In Court on TKO8 Television is brought to you in part by Campbell Bonding Company. Even the best of us make mistakes, so when trouble finds you, trust Campbell Bonding Company to help you through what can be a confusing and sometimes frightening experience. Jim, Robert, and Cole Campbell work as a family to offer your family understanding and compassion during a very difficult time. Campbell Bonding Company can help get your family back together quickly and confidentially. And in every step of the process, they're there for you. In times of trouble, let their family help your family. Campbell Bonding Company, 870-741-1138. Alicia Claiborne out of Newton County 17-35, charged with forgery. Are you Miss Claiborne? Yes, sir. Who is your lawyer, ma'am? I filled out for a public defender. Okay. What was the last part? I have not seen one yet. Okay, we'll, we'll, take, we'll take a look at that. Okay, ma'am, I've appointed the public defender's office to represent you. It appears you're here for an arraignment. How does she plead? Not guilty, Judge. Okay, we'll enter the plea of not guilty. And Uni, when will her next appearance be? Her will be on August 9th. August 9th at 10 o'clock in Jasper at the Newton County Courthouse. Your next appearance. Thank you. Anything else? Do you have a bond set, ma'am? Um, $5,000 Are you able to make that, Ms. Claiborne? No, sir, I cannot. Can you make any kind of a bond? Uh, I'm, 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 I'm incarcerated on um, other, uh, more, well, um, more, I think I figured out I'm hoping on the 10th, I'm hoping a bond, but right now I, I can't make it. Okay. Are the, is that a felony charge you're in custody on? Yeah. A different charge? No. No. It's misdemeanor. You have to Okay. No, don't Okay. That's all right now, Judge. Okay. I'm not catching what they're saying. Okay. Set up a misdemeanor. <coughs> okay, that's all we can do right now, ma'am. Thank you. State versus Larry Childress, 17 33. Okay. Terroristic threatening and criminal mischief. Yes.
Yes, sir. I've appointed the public defender's office to represent you. You've already entered a plea of not guilty. We've probably issued a scheduling order, maybe not. Do you know if one's been issued, you? Well, at any rate, it, it, we'll, we'll issue a no scheduling order if we have not already. Yeah, they can be all we can do today, sir. Thank you. State versus Jordan Hampton, 15 14. It's a revocation hearing. It's previously a drug case and theft case. Mr. Hampton, do you have a lawyer? Uh, yes, Your Honor. I've talked for the public attention's office. I believe they gave me a strange call. Okay. Um, may I say Are you already back from the penitentiary? Yes, Your Honor, he is. I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm not even been transferred yet. I was just wondering maybe if uh, we can come up with a plea agreement, maybe run us concurrent. Uh, Your Honor, the only real reason we were bringing him back is that he he had been given a 346, and we had intended to withdraw his, his 346. Okay. But that was it. Well, we'll just enter a plea of not guilty, and I'll set the matter for August 9th in uh, – you can. That's all we can do today, sir. Thank you. Make it up. Jeremy DeRoe. Yes, sir. Yeah, we can take his case up. <clears throat> Are you Jeremy DeRoe? Yes, sir. Okay, you were... Uh, Currently have been arrested for an alleged probation violation out of, I guess, Boone County District Court. The judge has set your bond at $1,340 cash only. Uh, this is your first appearance before court. You have a right to remain silent. Anything you say might well be used against you in court. You have a right to a lawyer. If you can't afford a lawyer, make application to the Public Defender's Office. And if you qualify, an attorney be rep appointed to represent you. And while you're in the Newton County Jail, subject to reg reasonable regulations, you're entitled to communicate with your family, friends, and your attorney. So that's all we can do today, sir. Thank you. State versus Preston Wilson, 17101, leaving the scene of an accident involving personal injury. I may approach your honor. Negotiated plea, and the plea agreement has been approved by the uh, mother of the victim in this case. Okay. Had a nice conversation with her a few weeks ago. Sir, I'm looking at the. Uh, Police statement and some conditions of suspension or probation. Have you gone over these documents? Uh, yes, sir. Do you feel you understand what's set out in the documents? Yes, sir. Do you understand the charge against you and the range of penalty if uh, you're convicted? Yes, sir. Are you pleading guilty to leaving the scene of an accident involving personal injury? Yes, sir. By entering your plea, you're giving up your right to have a jury trial and you cannot appeal. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. Are you entering this plea freely and voluntarily? Yes, sir. There's a recommendation as to what your sentence should be in the plea statement. Other than that, have you been promised anything? Other than that, have you been promised anything? Yeah, no. Okay. Have you been threatened or pressured to get you to change your plea? Yes, sir. And you're pleading guilty because you're, in fact, guilty? Yes, sir. Okay. What's the basic factual basis for this? Your Honor, back on... Uh Turn back to information on March 15th of this year. Uh, Mr. Wilson was traveling on Highway 7 South, uh, Pine Street area here in town, and uh, there was an individual crossing the street in a crosswalk. And uh, Mr. Wilson struck that individual and then uh, drove away from the scene. He later turned himself in at the police department. Is this true, sir? Yes, sir. Okay. This time, sir, I accept your plea. I would place you on three years <coughs> probation. You're ordered to pay $200 in cost, a $1,000 fine, a $20 booking fee, $1,516.38 in restitution. Pay what you owe at a minimum rate of $100 per month beginning within 30 days after your release, and you make your payments to the Sheriff's Department. 
And this is under Act 346 of 1975. And Mr. Mom has explained that to you, I'm sure. Yes, sir. If you successfully complete probation, remember to you have to petition to get this removed. Yes, sir. Sealed, I suppose. sealed is the word. Not removed. If I may approach, Your Honor, we have the sentencing order ready okay. on this one. Very good. You'll just go with this lady over here. She'll tell you what to do. Thank you. People around the country are noticing North Arkansas College as one of the best deals around. North Ark was just named one of the most affordable community colleges in the nation, costing about one-third of what you would pay at a university. This fall, North Ark is offering paid internships to help students earn while they learn. Explore the full list of fall classes at northark.edu and enroll today. Enroll now. Classes start August 14th. For quality, value, and convenience, think North Ark first. We're your college. The Townhouse Cafe in downtown Harrison is offering a great reason to wake up on Saturday mornings. Their incredible brunch. Starting at 7 a.m., you can enjoy all of your traditional breakfast favorites or some of these decadent dishes. Eggs Benedict, featuring an English muffin topped with ham, two eggs, made any way you like, and topped with fresh-made hollandaise sauce. Plus, you'll also get your choice of hash browns or home fries. Perhaps something even more delectable. Townhouse Cafe's fabulous U.S. farm-raised butterfly trout grilled with a drizzle of hollandaise sauce, two eggs any way you like, hash browns or home fries, and either a biscuit or toast on the side. Absolutely delicious. Saturday brunch at the Townhouse Cafe in downtown Harrison. I'm Randall. I work at the on-site lab at Dental Creations on the Square at Harrison. Working with Dr. Wanda is great. She's taught me a lot and showed me a lot, and she gives us the freedom to get one-on-one -on -one with the patient. If there's a problem, we can actually come out of the back and do what's best for the patient. Having this on-site lab here with the doctors, that's really nice. Dental Creations on the Square in Harrison, next to the Big Red Boot. Join Sammy Klein Thursdays and Fridays during the TK08 local newscast for this week's closing livestock market report. Made possible by Quality Feed Grains of Harrison and Belfont. Quality Feed Grains has you covered. Everything for cattle, pets, deer, equine, poultry, seed and spray, show feed, and garden. Check their website, qualityfeedgrains.com, now for this month's special. Quality Feed Grains of Harrison and Belfont. Proud sponsors of the livestock report with Sammy Klein on Harrison's broadcast station, TKO Channel 8. You know, we should always remember to have a working smoke detector where we sleep. Let's go, let's go. Okay, we're all safe, we're all safe. In an emergency, you need a meeting place outside the whole family can meet so that you know everyone is safe. is here and Sisters Flower and Gift Shop has recently received a large selection of new and unique items from colorful tableware, centerpieces, wall decor, home accent, razorback products, and a baby department with clothes and accessories. Sisters has the perfect gift for any occasion. For the future bride and groom, Sisters offers a complete bridal registry. 
birthday, wedding, anniversary, or just because. Sisters has something for everyone. Sisters Flower and Gift Shop. We are so much more than flowers. <laughs> Dash 23 State versus Julie Anderson filing false re police reports and theft were the original charge. It looks like this is a revocation. Okay, there's a revocation hearing scheduled for today. Judge, I believe what happened was she was served with the uh, warrant on the revocation and was given Judge Webb's court to appear. A not true plea was entered, and then she was ordered to reappear on this date for a hearing date to be set. Okay. She was served with the warrant on May 29th. May 29th? Yes, sir. Set it for hearing on July 21st. Thank you, Your Honor. That's all we can do today, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you, sir. State versus William Bryant, 17165, drugs and firearms, controlled substances, theft by receiving. It also has 15 19, which is a revocation. Is there anything to be done in 15 19? Judge, he was served with a warrant on a probation violation, and he needs to have a first appearance in that case. 17-65? 17-I'm 17 17-165. I'm sorry, 17-165. Uh, he needs <coughs> I probably I think needs this, this was a reappearance just to get on your docket. He pled not guilty last Friday in front of Judge Webb. Probably just needs a scheduling order. Okay. And judge, if we set the revocation hearing on uh, July 28th, we'll still be within the 60 days. Okay. We'll issue a scheduling order in 17165. Okay, and 15 19. What date did you want to set it on, sir? Judge, I, I did the math, and we are still within the 60 days if we schedule the hearing for uh, July 28th. Okay, the hearing on the revocation will be scheduled, set rather, for July 28th. Okay, anything else? Judge, I Mr. Bryant, do you have a bond set? Uh, yes, sir. Okay, in both cases or just the new case? Yes, sir. I have a pro Okay. That's it, Judge. State versus Cody Chapman, 17172, sexual assault, sexual indecency with a child, domestic battery. Do you have a lawyer, sir? No. Okay. Fill out, uh, pick up an application, fill it out, turn it into the, uh, the jail there. And I'll have your cases before Judge Webb. I'll have you reappear on July 7th at 9 o'clock. Okay. Thank you, sir. 15-213, State versus Amanda Henderson, possession of controlled substance. And this is on a revocation. Good morning, ma'am. Do you have a lawyer? Judge, 
think she's made application that we submitted. Okay. She needs to submit that one with it. I think Judge Webb has appointed us, and so we'll take the okay. case. Okay. All right. I have a point. We, the Public Defender's Office has been appointed to represent you, ma'am. And uh, is she entering a plea of not true to yes. these others? Yes, Your Honor. Okay. When would you like it set for hearing, sir? Judge, based on when she was served with the warrant, we'll need to set this one for uh, July 20th, or 21st, I'm sorry. Okay. The hearing's July 21st at 10 o'clock or soon thereafter as we can get to it. I'll just set it at the amount you owe, $2,205 cash. I'll set it at that. There's other allegations. $167. That's all we can do today, ma'am. State versus Darla Morrow out of Boone County, 13-221. Domestic battery, assault. It's on revocation. Ma'am, do you have a lawyer? Okay. What do you do for a living, ma'am? Okay. For just for the purpose of the arraignment, I'm, I'm going to appoint the public defender's office and we'll enter a plea of, of uh, not true. And let's see, when do we need to set the hearing? Judge, based on her arrest date on the warrant, we can schedule this one for July 28th. Okay, we'll set the hearing for July 28th and, and uh, y'all can get a, the application. If you have to get another one, even. Anything else? Yes. Say it again. Let me look. She says the petition alleges she's been on probation for quite some time and that was quite a bit on her monetary obligations. Where, where would you live, ma'am? I have to I tell you what, why don't you communicate with your attorney's office and they can talk to the prosecutor. Maybe they can agree on uh, an arrangement or something to present to me. Because if you've been homeless, we, we need a little better plan. But they'll work on it with you. Okay. Well, we'll we'll see. But that's all we can do right now. Even the best of us make mistakes, so when trouble finds you, trust Campbell Bonding Company to help you through what can be a confusing and sometimes frightening experience. Jim, Robert, and Cole Campbell work as a family to offer your family understanding and compassion during a very difficult time. Campbell Bonding Company can help get your family back together quickly and confidentially. And in every step of the process, they're there for you. In times of trouble, let their family help your family. Campbell Bonding Company, 870-741-1138. When you support a locally owned pharmacy, you're contributing to the growth of a community. The dollars you spend stay right here to support our local community. Healthmark pharmacies are locally owned pharmacies. There is one right here. Healthmark pharmacists have a crucial commitment to their community because just like you, they support their community. Healthmark pharmacies are locally owned and hometown proud. Harrison has a Healthmark now. Sam Alexander Pharmacy, on the square in downtown Harrison. 
Health Mart, caring for you and about you. Ah, sweet Louise. Do you dream of Hercules? To be the best dressed boy in town. Where you sure of something. The best there ever was. The new Sport Heritage Line. Well, it won't mean nothing. Unless you try my life and bring it right to your Louise. Only from Yamaha. This is Josh from Harrison Battery and Tire. Lots of folks have been asking about roadside assistance, and now it's available. 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, we can quickly and efficiently take care of your tires and battery issues with one phone call. Professional, secure, comforting to get you back on the road. No matter what time, no matter what type of vehicle you drive, call for details at 870-741-7041. Harrison Battery and Tire on the curve of Main Street in Harrison. HarrisonBatteryandTire.com. Big enough to serve, small enough to care. Summer is here and Sisters Flower and Gift Shop has recently received a large selection of new and unique items from colorful tableware, centerpieces, wall decor, home accent, razorback products, and a baby department with clothes and accessories. Sisters has the perfect gift for any occasion. For the future bride and groom, Sisters offers a complete bridal registry. Birthday, wedding, anniversary, or just because. Sisters has something for everyone. Sisters Flower and Gift Shop. We are so much more than flowers. Join Sammy Klein Thursdays and Fridays during the TK08 local newscast for this week's closing livestock market report. Made possible by Quality Feed Grains of Harrison and Belfont. Quality Feed Grains has you covered. Everything for cattle, pets, deer, equine, poultry, seed and spray, show feed, and garden. Check their website, qualityfeedgrains.com, now for this month's special. Quality Feed Grains of Harrison and Belfont. Proud sponsors of the livestock report with Sammy Klein on Harrison's broadcast the time station. Is right. TKO to enroll Channel at North Ark this fall. For a limited time, you can attend college free if you are pursuing careers in registered nursing, surgical technology, networking, pre-engineering, IT, and more. Our future scholarships are now available to qualified applicants. Enroll now. Classes start August 14th. For quality, value, and convenience, think North Arc first. We're your college. Ah, sweet the do you dream of Hercules? To be the best dressed boy in town. Where you sure of something. The best there ever was. The new Sport Heritage Line. Well, it won't mean nothing. Unless you try my life and bring it right to your Louise. Only from Yamaha. Versus Christopher Rampley, 17 173, domestic battery. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Do you have a lawyer, sir? Is he made up? You fill up? Okay. okay, well. Chopping up. We can't. Can you hear me there in the jail? Yeah, I'm hearing it pointing towards you so I can hear you a little bit better. Okay, sir, I've appointed the public defender's office to represent you, and you're here for an arraignment. And does he enter a plea of not guilty? Yes, Your Honor. Okay, we'll enter the plea of not guilty. And when when are we we'll be scheduling folks to appear? You need to reappear for August 25th. Your next appearance is August 25th for a pretrial at uh, 9:30. As soon thereafter, as we can get to it. Is there anything else to be done? Mr. Rampling, do you have a bond set? 
Do you have a bond sixteen k? I'll come and I can get a reduction since it's my first event. Okay. Where do you live at, sir? Live at? Where do you live at? I live here in Harrison. <clears throat> That's how I was. So I got to find a new job. I got lost my job in here and uh, take parenting classes while I was out. Your Honor, according to his <clears throat> NCIC printout, he was convicted of a domestic assault in the state of Iowa in 2008. Based on the allegations in this new case, the state feels that uh, current bond is reasonable. I'm going to leave the bond where it's at. Thank you, Your Honor. Your Honor, if he does make that bond, the state would ask a condition of his release be have no contact with the alleged victim. No contact with the alleged victim if you release. State versus Valerie Chatswell, 14-87. It's originally a drug case, and this is a revocation. She also has let's see, 16-307, which is maybe a battery. Yes, that's a pending case, Your Honor. The 2014-87 is a probation revocation. Uh, the defense had filed uh, for forensic evaluations in both cases. It's our understanding that the evaluation has taken place, but for some reason we still have not received the report. Uh, I'm getting a head nod from Judy Case. I'm assuming there's not one in the clerk's files either. Is, is that in both cases? It should be, Your Honor. Okay. That's right. right. Well, I don't guess there's anything we can do until that comes back. We can just have a reset to uh, the 21st. 21st. That's okay. our next available docket, just to see if we have a report. We'll have you come back on the 21st. Thank you. Out of Newton County, 17-24, State versus Elijah Scott. Theft by receiving. That's the charge. Okay. What's the other one? 1724 and 1723. All right. What are, what are we here for today on his cases? Judge, I don't think he's been arraigned on 1723. I think that's correct, Your Honor, and uh, we have a discovery packet also for counsel. All right. Yes. We can get an application for the public defender on 23 Okay. Uh, what, what do your documents show we're here for? Pre-trial. Okay. Well, I've appointed a public defender to represent him, and of course we can have a pre-trial later if we need one, but at this time are you aware of any? Judge, this is uh, Mr. Friend's case, and he asked me to stand in on him today, oh, okay. and he didn't have any All right. pre-trial issues. Okay. At least that I'm aware of in the 1724. I'm not sure about the 23. We just got the discovery on that, Judge. We'll leave it as scheduled, and if y'all need a pretrial, let us know. Yes, sir. That'll be all, sir. Thank you. Becoming a clinical medical assistant offers a quick transition from college to career. This fall, North Arc is offering a clinical medical assistant course to prepare you for the job in doctor's offices or health clinics. Clinical medical assisting is included in the Arkansas Future Scholarship, available for qualified applicants. 
Enroll now. Classes start August 14th. For quality, value, and convenience, think North Arc first. We're your college. The Townhouse Cafe in downtown Harrison is offering a great reason to wake up on Saturday mornings. Their incredible brunch. Starting at 7 a.m., you can enjoy all of your traditional breakfast favorites or some of these decadent dishes. Eggs Benedict, featuring an English muffin topped with ham, two eggs, made any way you like, and topped with fresh-made hollandaise sauce. Plus, you'll also get your choice of hash browns or home fries. Perhaps something even more delectable. Townhouse Cafe's fabulous U.S. farm-raised butterfly trout grilled with a drizzle of hollandaise sauce, two eggs any way you like, hash browns or home fries, and either a biscuit or toast on the side. Absolutely delicious. Saturday brunch at the Townhouse Cafe in downtown Harrison. Join Sammy Klein Thursdays and Fridays during the TK08 local newscast for this week's closing livestock market report. Made possible by Quality Feed Grains of Harrison and Belfont. Quality Feed Grains has you covered. Everything for cattle, pets, deer, equine, poultry, seed and spray, show feed, and garden. Check their website, qualityfeedgrains.com, now for this month's special. Quality Feed Grains of Harrison and Belfont. Proud sponsors of the Livestock Report with Sammy Klein on Harrison's broadcast station, TKO Channel 8. This is Josh from Harrison Battery and Tire. Lots of folks have been asking about roadside assistance, and now it's available. 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, we can quickly and efficiently take care of your tires and battery issues with one phone call. Professional, secure, comforting to get you back on the road. No matter what time, no matter what type of vehicle you drive, call for details at 870-741-7041. Harrison Battery and Tire on the curve of Main Street in Harrison, HarrisonBatteryandTire.com. Big enough to serve, small enough to care. Ah, sweet Louise, do you dream of Hercules? To be the best jazz boy in town, where you sure are something, the best there ever was. The new Sport Heritage Line. Well, it won't mean nothing, unless I try my life and bring it right to you, Louise. Only from Yamaha. Hello, this is Michelle from Nature's Wonders. Are you trying to get out and take in these beautiful days, but find that you end up sneezing, itching, and getting all sorts of bites or rashes? Don't let outdoor allergies, bugs, or poisonous plants keep you from enjoying all that the Ozarks has to offer this season. Stop in at Nature's Wonders and let us show you the products we carry that can help with the challenging parts of nature so that you can enjoy all the wonders. Find us on Highway 65 just down from Thompson's Ace Hardware. Nature's Wonders, the natural living store. County docket Tiffany Austin 15 135 breaking or entering theft and this must be on a it's on revocation it is your honor however uh, Mr. Hancock has provided me with proof of completion of treatment at Wilbur Mills Uh, I reached out to uh, Miss Austin's supervising officer and uh, she is now back in compliance and based on what she has done since the petition was filed uh, we're requesting that the petition be dismissed very well petition dismissed Free to go. State versus Josephine Bound, 17 87, possession of controlled substances. She also has 17 89, which is a similar case. 21st. We can, unless you think we can do it today. Okay. Judge, we have a plea agreement in principle. Uh, paperwork will need to be typed up if we could have her reappear on the 21st. Very good. 21st, 9.30, yes, ma'am. State versus Lee Bra- Bradley, 16-143. It's on revocation. Earlier charges were theft, 
criminal mischief, burglary, firearms for certain persons. Judge, she is on the revocation docket for today. I believe Mr. Hancock was going to ask for some time to meet with her, discuss the case, see, see where we are for this afternoon. That's true, Judge. Okay, you must recall it. Yes, sir, please. Okay. Things I'm being revocated for have <coughs> We'll, we'll recall your case, ma'am. State versus Terry Masters, or Terry Connor, 17157, forgery, theft. She's already entered a plea of not guilty, and uh, I guess she's just preparing to get on our docket, but we've already issued a scheduling order. Judge, I uh, think we're going to request that she be transferred to Judge Webb's docket. Do you, do you have a pending case in there? Already? Yes. Uh, she already has a pending case in that division. If it's accepted, I'll certainly grant that. Thank you. Thank you. When did she get uh, When you want her back? I think I have her division four case. I'm, I'm not sure when she's scheduled to reappear in that one. 714 is what she's saying. Okay. okay. That, that'll be when you reappear, July 14th. Judge, I'll go ahead and provide Mr. Hancock a copy of our file. State versus Jessica Eddings, 17 109, burglary, breaking or entering, theft, criminal mischief. Criminal trespass. Judge, we're set for a pretrial. There's uh, no wish, no motions pending. Okay, we'll leave it as scheduled. Free to go, ma'am. Thank you. State versus Annette Goulet, sixteen two thirty one, capital murder, or attempted, I guess, carrying a weapon. Yeah, Judge, may we approach? Yes. Matter will be continued on defense motion until September 8th at 10 o'clock. Thank you. Thank you. What is that? State versus Louis Riddell, 17 90, controlled substances. Mm -hmm. Here for us, see. Judge, okay. Mr. Carter wrote in our file from last Friday that apparently there was an agreement on the record to transfer this case to Division Three. Yeah, they tr transferred it back, I guess. Oh. Well, we'll, we'll it, take it, Judge. Is there a revocation pending? It's in front of us, Your Honor. Are you aware of a revocation case? Judge, um, if there is one, I was not aware of it. Are you aware of one, Louis? Uh, yeah. Well, let me look, run his name through here and see what I can find. Don't look too hard. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Well, this shows he has. Shh. This shows he has one open case. To show the docket number you're on. For the open case. Yes. Seventeen dash nine. Okay, so at least no pending revocation that we know of. Look at this one here. He may have had one pending in the past.
Oh, here it is. <laughs> it's, uh, but apparently it's not too bad trouble because there's some monitoring. 16183. And it says here that uh, scheduled for monitoring on August 11th. Is that one of my days? Yeah. Yes, that's ah. right. Yes, that is Joe. Okay. Well, we'll just schedule this the newer case out. Go from there. It's already scheduled. Okay, it's already scheduled out. Okay, good deal. See you. Thank you. The Townhouse Cafe in downtown Harrison is offering a great reason to wake up on Saturday mornings their incredible brunch. Starting at 7 a.m., you can enjoy all of your traditional breakfast favorites or some of these decadent dishes. Eggs Benedict, featuring an English muffin topped with ham, two eggs, made any way you like, and topped with fresh-made hollandaise sauce. Plus, you'll also get your choice of hash browns or home fries. Perhaps something even more delectable. Townhouse Cafe's fabulous U.S. farm-raised butterfly trout grilled with a drizzle of hollandaise sauce, two eggs any way you like, hash browns or home fries, and either a biscuit or toast on the side. Absolutely delicious. Saturday brunch at the Townhouse Cafe in downtown Harrison. You know, we should always remember to have a working smoke detector where we sleep. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, we're all safe. We're all safe. In an emergency, you need a meeting place outside the whole family can meet so that you know everyone is safe. North Arkansas College. You know what I'm doing? I'm working with robots, 3D printers, CNC machines, fixing stuff you wouldn't believe. When I graduate, I've got employers waiting for me. Here's the list. No joke. Upwards of 70,000 a year out of the gate. Not bad for two years. And at only around four grand a year, you do the math. Offering an Associates of Applied Science in Industrial Electronics and certificates in Manufacturing Technology and Industrial Electronics. Who would have thought I get to build a future? Mine. Ah, sweet Louise, do you dream of Hercules? To be the best dance boy in town, where you sure are something, the best there ever was. The new Sport Heritage Line. Well, it won't mean nothing, unless you try my life and bring it right to you, Louise. Only from Yamaha. I'm Brittany. I work in the operatory. I assist the doctor and I make our patients as comfortable as possible. I've never worked for anybody that seems to care for her staff like she does and really cares for her patients. The best thing about working here really is seeing people get the smile they've desired for years and seeing the outcome of happy tears and smiles. Dental Creations on the Square in Harrison, next to the Big Red Boot. Hello, this is Michelle from Nature's Wonders. Are you trying to get out and take in these beautiful days, but find that you end up sneezing, itching, and getting all sorts of bites or rashes? Don't let outdoor allergies, bugs, or poisonous plants keep you from enjoying all that the Ozarks has to offer this season. Stop in at Nature's Wonders and let us show you the products we carry that can help with the challenging parts of nature so that you can enjoy all the wonders. Find us on Highway 65 just down from Thompson's Ace Hardware. Nature's Wonders, the natural living store. Sam Alexander Pharmacy has expanded and is now offering many additional products and services. Their new pharmaceutical compounding area allows them to create products to fit the unique needs of a customer. They also have added Spinco Orthotic Shoes and Sandals, Dr. Comfort Diabetic Shoes, Baby Gifts by Aiden and Anias, and Toys by Melissa and Doug. Stop in today and let them help you with any of your specialty pharmaceutical needs. Sam Alexander Pharmacy, your local Health Mart Pharmacy in Harrison. State versus Michael Taylor, 17 93.
possession of controlled substances, paraphernalia, driving on suspended. Leave it as scheduled. State versus Tasha Watt, seventeen one fifty nine. Possession of control substances, paraphernalia, driving is suspended. This is for arraignment today. Was the public defender's office appointed? Yes, sir. Okay. Did she enter a plea of not guilty? Yes, Your Honor. Okay, we'll enter that plea of, of not guilty, and we've scheduled, I think we've scheduled the matter. It's already scheduled. Okay. When is her next appearance? 825. August 25th at 930. Okay. Okay. Uh, 16-79. Stephen McIntyre out of Newton County. Down him, that's right. 16-59, Mark Mock, drugs. Your Honor, I believe there's been a continuance filed on that matter. 16-85, Nathan Mock, terroristic threatening. Here's Mr. Here's Mr. Mock. Here are the Mocks. Did you ask for did someone ask for a continuance in the mark? Mr. Gibson's requested a continuance from Mark Mock. Okay, this is this is Mark Mock. Your uh, lawyers asked for a continuance, and I'll, I'll uh, grant that, sir. Okay. And on Nathan Mock, did, did uh, I don't. Sure. I don't In Court on TKOA Television is brought to you in part by Campbell Bonding Company. Even the best of us make mistakes, so when trouble finds you, trust Campbell Bonding Company to help you through what can be a confusing and sometimes frightening experience. Jim, Robert, and Cole Campbell work as a family to offer your family understanding and compassion during a very difficult time. Campbell Bonding Company can help get your family back together quickly and confidentially. And in every step of the process, they're there for you. In times of trouble, let their family help your family. Campbell Bonding Company, 870-741-1138. Uh, when I first went to the museum, the Sammy Rose was the uh, director at that time, and she was coming to the nursing home and feeding her uncle. I was going to the nursing home and feeding my mother, and she took me to the museum, and I walked in there, and of course it's nothing like it is, is now. I mean, it was pretty crude and really at that point, you know, and I just fell in love with what they were doing, what she was trying to, to accomplish there about preserving the history of 
of Boone County. Of course, I was born and raised in Boone County. The people, the people down at that, the museum, oh my gosh, they have meant more to me than anything. You know, the ones I worked with down there, and of course there was Fred Hudson, you know, and, that, uh, and Avril, remember Avril, and oh, I don't know, just different ones who've come in there and worked, and I just fell in love with everybody. And then the people that come in from out of town, it's amazing, so many of them I'd maybe gone to high school with, you know, or uh, some of their family had gone to high school with. To support it, yes, because you're not getting any help from anywhere else except total you know, donations coming from the people that come in there and from the people that show a love for our county and our history in this area. So, um, goodness, yes, it needs to be supported. Kids need to be come too, and they love it. Kids love it when they come. I just, just feel very, very strongly that the history of our county is there right there. I think that museum is one of the best in the world, let's put it that way. <laughs>